We've got bridge construction going on. Uh, the Root River is right behind us and we've got the contractors working on piers in the river and the abutments. They're building a bridge for the new southbound 94 and uh, the weather's great. So they're really getting some work done. Just a few weeks ago, this was ice behind me. So the contractors are really happy that they can get uh, the bridge work done and we can get this freeway built. Of course, we'll be building four lanes of concrete pavement to go over this bridge as well. So the work is going on hot and heavy right now. We will have three lanes in each direction. There will be some ramps closed and some interchange access will be restricted. That's to be expected when we're building an interchange reconstruct. But I think it's gonna be a pretty good year. Three lanes, both directions, north and south, all the way to our Illinois border. And uh, we will have speeds restricted to 60 miles an hour. So you do wanna be careful when you're coming through. There will be men and materials coming in and out of the work zone. So we do want drivers to be cautious. We're planning on taking the southbound traffic stream that's head south, uh, south of college and we're going to cross them over onto the northbound side. We will maintain three lanes as they cross over and head south uh, down to I-94. One of the impacts with that crossover is that we'll be closing the ramps to Rawson Avenue, which is the interchange just south of college, and those ramps will be closed southbound off, southbound on. So one of the recommendations is that you get off a little earlier at college, and if you're coming from the north or, or from the west, you might want to exit earlier, like you're going to the airport and get on that collector distributor ramp, that does take you right to college and can bypass a little bit of the lane drops that we're going to have set up southbound. So that's a good tip.